Hello everybody, Happy New Year. I'm so excited for this year and how can we not say this welcome back. So for this year, we actually have some goals for the channel which I'll quickly be doing before we get into this video. So yes, we have goals this year. So basically, it's just about how much I post, how nicely I put things together, and how much I organize this channel. So I hope that these goals will get me through the year with flying colors. Anyways, today I'll be showing you guys how I give my AG doll a makeover, along with some tips on how you can give your doll a makeover. Since my last video, my doll has been picking up some dust. Yeah, remember to. And like if you wanted to. Now onto the video. You can see here, this is my doll Sydney Lee. She has not been given a makeover in two years and hopefully you guys can give your doll a makeover this time too. Anyways, on to tip number one, which is clear the skin. So obviously you can do this by using a magic eraser to remove any scuff marks and I also like to use antibacterial wipes. You can also repaint the skin later. This isn't too necessary, but I did this with some of my watercolors, which are Staedtler branded. Remember that this is going to be permanent. Also try to condition the hair with a mild shampoo or conditioner just so that you don't kind of damage the hair. And then alongside that, you can also straighten the hair later, but make sure that you wet it first to avoid burning because if you do not wet it first, it will 100% burn I need to not want that as this is not real human hair, keep that in mind please. And if you are scared to do this, which I 100% get because you are literally applying direct heat to your doll's hair, then there will be a video in the description that you can watch before you do that. And also feel free to use makeup, I used a freckle tint to give my doll some freckles. <laughs> And also give it a new outfit and if you like a new hairstyle because the chances are that if you are giving it a makeover, you probably have not changed its outfit in a while. And after all of that, this is finally the finished result. I love it so much and I think it looks so much more prettier than before and it was kind of my dream doll makeover. Anyways guys, thank you so much for watching. This was my first video for January and I definitely enjoyed it and I think that new year sort of new doll was a good change. Anyways, I'll be seeing you guys next time on this channel, and thanks for watching. Bye!